<laughs> hey there folks welcome to minecraft uh this is gonna be our first episode in a series a lot of you guys have uh been asking why do i like this game so much if you guys know uh the other games i play on the channel um so we're gonna be going over this game in this series and we're gonna start it like for people that don't know anything and if you are new to the game give it a chance trust me you uh you might like it uh i was one of the people that used to laugh at this game i was a little slow to getting it like some other people and uh definitely uh i laughed at it thought it was a kid's game and then until you play survival mode you would definitely Probably be pretty much right, but the survival part of the game is a lot of fun for any age. There is a reason it is number one in the world for games. So, first things first, we're going to punch a tree. Now, I'm going to talk to you folks as we get through this tree. There we go. Alright. One thing you need to know, guys, Minecraft's a survival game. And if you haven't played survival games, let me tell you one thing about them. If you do not start the game out by having to punch a tree, you aren't playing a good survival game. So the game just isn't blocks. Now, what you need to know about the game is it's just blocks. <laughs> now, there's more to it, but essentially the game is based around blocks. Uh, I mean, uh, I guess I don't know any other way to describe it, but um, and there's a lot of cra crafting. The worlds are infinite. For example, you can see we are at our coordinates are 11,000 by 3,000. The middle number is actually our height. So if I jump up, you see it goes up to 64. And we're going to be doing some stuff. But I'm going to punch these leaves, I guess, here. To see if we get lucky, get another apple. So we got some food to eat. So if you guys are not familiar with um, Minecraft, this will be a perfect series for you guys because you'll be able to watch how we do stuff on this whole world. And there's going to be a lot to do on this world. Here's a sample of what we've done in the past in survival mode. So there's a lot to do in this game, you know, with animals and crafting and all that stuff, including uh, there's different types of realms in here. And there is different types of bosses as well to be. So first things first, we really got to get going. The sun is already at midday, and we do not want to be out when it's dark. There is monsters that will come out at dark. So let's get this crafted into wood. So obviously Minecraft, there's a lot of mine and crafting. So first things first, we're going to build a crafting table here. Let's put it down right here. I guess this is where we're going to station our doohickey for right now. Um, and let's get some sticks and as you would assume we have tools and other things to mine these blocks and trees and defend ourselves with swords so first off we're just going to make a sword and a pick we we don't care so also up here if you guys aren't familiar it'll pop up stuff but you can also use a search bar like if we wanted to craft a furnace for example we type in a couple of the letters and you can see it we can it shows us how to make it in that crafting table what it takes all the items stuff like that we'll be getting into a furnace actually pretty soon but first let's clear that bar so it doesn't do that for us we don't want to be doing that we we got we're in a good spot here uh there's horses there's sugar cane actually let's build a chest right here that's just wood and what we're gonna do is we're gonna place some seeds in there um we could let's place one sugar cane unless something goes wrong so we're gonna um 
we're gonna get the sugar cane down and spread out uh, also you can go in the water it is there's some really cool uh water biomes in the game that's another thing is there's different biomes so right here we're in the plains but up there is mountains and and there's going to be a lot to do But first, things first, let's kill some stuff. So that, that uh, also, I probably should mention down on the bottom left, them hearts, that's your health. Um, and uh, the one on the right, the looking ham things, that is actually your food level. There is no water. Okay, so this is important. We want to get the sheep. A lot of the mobs will drop stuff here in the game. There we go. And you see that little green speckled deal? That's a level thing. So when we collect them, you'll see that green bar go up. And we'll get a number between the hearts and the haunches. Oh, wow. We almost got a place to sleep. We need to get some wool to make a bed. Oh, and look at that. There's some more sheep over here. It is really handy spawning in the... Uh, plains biome like this and we're and we're right by a river too which is nice so um let's go over now uh, normally i would collect stone right away but that looks like quite the little trip oh man it's already getting pretty close to dark here so what we're gonna do is we're gonna put one more chest down so if you connect two chests together you can you can make a bigger storage so we are actually gonna go do that and we are gonna eat this apple and to get some more wood, we're going to plant down some more trees. They will grow eventually. Um, and uh, that will help us gather some more wood. Because we don't have a whole lot of trees around here, folks. Alright, we're getting close to the sun going down here. So we got to hurry. Um, the first day is real important in this game to try to get something done. Um, we do... Oh, that's right. We can make a bed. We should do that. And what we're going to do is we're going to place that down. And we're going to set our spawn. And we can only sleep at night. And the good news is, is if we, you know what? Hmm. Let's actually take that with us in case it gets dark on our travels. But we got to head towards these mountains here. Um, we're actually going to grab some stone i wish i had some food to eat but we got to cook that can't eat the raw meat well you kind of can but it's kind of a waste and we got a lot of white horses so uh this is going to be really cool so this series guys by the way if you guys uh do like this we're going to be doing quite a bit on here um oh there's a cave we are not ready for that quite yet um so down in the caves, there's resources. Let's just grab some of this cobblestone right here. And um, so there is resources we're going to have to go down for. But right now, we're going to try to upgrade from just our plain wood tools. There's different tiers of tools in this game. And actually, this could work as a makeshift hidey hole at night. But we do have a bed, so we'll be able to skip night can sleep through night and we're not ready for the monsters yet and it would be nice if we did get some torches light up our area back there but uh, we're gonna have to have some of them trees grow also we could kill this chicken there we go oh and donkeys wow we had this is we're getting a lot of good animals here to spawn um and Let's run back down. There's another little cave right there. So we're sitting pretty good. Ooh, it's getting dark, folks. All right. What I'm going to do is I might wait till darkness. You can just get a little bit of glimpse of the monsters that come out while we're doing that. We're going to build a furnace so we can cook that food. We'll put it right here. And we are going to actually go ahead. Uh, we got bottom slot is we're going to burn some stuff. Let's burn some of this wood. Let's get some chicken cooking. So let's see if we can see a couple baddies come out. Um, should be coming out any second now. 
Where are you, baddies? So there's zombies, skeletons, a bunch of bad guys in this world. Um, oh, there's one right there. There's two. Now they're going to start attacking us if they get too close to us. What we, oh, there's some more. Okay, all right. We I proved my point. There's, there's, uh, we'll go to sleep here. As you can see, once you wake up, they do start to burn during the daylight. You'll see some of them head for water so they don't burn up. Here's a spider right here. Let's see if we can take this spider really quick and not die. Should be no problem. We should have done this with a stone sword, but but you can see how many take it takes quite a bit of hits. We're gonna need that strength for later. Alright, let's go run over here. Let's work on we got some food now, so let's keep cooking this up. Did any of our trees grow yet? No. And it's raining. Alright. So actually during raining, I wish we had a fishing pole because this would be a great time to fish. Look at that. A unique seven pound salmon. Oh look, a monster fish. Clearly, that was a fishing planet joke, guys. But in all seriousness, you can get a lot of cool stuff from fishing. I'm a little worried about that skeleton being there. We should probably have slept really early. By the way, this is a multiplayer server, so later on we're going to be playing with other people once everybody knows the basics of the game. If you are kind of more experienced to the game, don't worry. We're... Uh, we're going to be doing some really crazy stuff in this world, so you got nothing to worry about. Um, let's actually go ahead and grab... Uh, don't look at me, skeleton. Let's grab this sugar cane here. Why it was on gravel, I don't know. Huh, must have spawned that way. That's weird. You can't place it down. All right, we got another sheep over here. And I think our first goal is... Um, Real quick, let's grab a little bit of wood. Now, I could make a wood um, axe, but that's really not going to help us out too much. Uh, it's basically about the same as speed as punching. So what we're going to do now is grab this wood, and we are going to head over here. Put it in, because we're going to want to make some charcoal. If you burn wood, you can turn... Turn it into charcoal, or there's a black iron or black coal in the mountains we can use for our next deal. What we're going to be doing while we're waiting for that to smelt up, however, let's grab oh, we have it on us already. Let's upgrade our tools so this one will take some stone, and we are going to upgrade to um, all stone tools here. Let's get that back out. Um, we got an axe. Oh, let's do this the right way here. Let's get our inventory right. Let's do that and that. I already threw my map away on the ground because you don't really need that when you have your coordinates. Um, what else do we going to need here? Uh, X. Uh, shovel. Oh, I accidentally did two X's there. So, and a hole. And we're going to go through all these tools eventually. Um, but let's really quick go ahead. Oh, that guy is super close um, in the background. So let's make a couple more and let's make some torches. Our first set of torches. That skeleton, when you're first starting out, a real tough cookie to beat. So we could just let him stay over there. We're going to torch up this area. So at night now, this will be... Um, a lot brighter. We should be able to work and not have an enemy spawn. So if you put, if there's any light to the game, they'll it'll stop them spawning. Most creatures, anyway. Oh, look, an apple. All right. So now let's try out our new stone um, axe. You can see how much quicker this is now. We're gonna gather up a little bit of wood, but I think. Um, for you guys watching, if you guys have any questions about this game, put it down below. Let me know what you think, 
And uh, I can't wait to see you guys next time, folks. Have a good one. Also, try to remember what this cave looks like. We're going to do some pretty epic things in here later, upcoming down the road. 